What's up guys, it's your boy Eric Lee and you're watching 31 and Counting. And if you're new to this channel, what we like to do is unbox things like this cool outlaw soap and uh, check out, see if it's hype or if it's hot. And uh, I got a good feeling about this. So it came, the box came in great condition from the bat. You know, the only thing you see like that's an issue on it, like right here, I did this in the house. I, I did that, I stored it somewhere and it got next to some of my equipment. But let's just look at the pretty side. So this is Outlaw Soap. They reached out to me. They said, hey, you've checked out a bunch of other soaps. Check out the best. Check out the one for the Texans. You know, all the cowboys and cowgirls out there in the big hills. And uh, I said big hills, big cowboy boots. Uh, and then go see how it compares to some of those you know, starter soaps. And yeah, I call things like Dr. Squash, so, uh, startup soaps, you know, kind of soaps that are for people who just want to start getting their swag on and try different scents outside of Dove and Dowl and other things like that. Sorry if it's taking me a while to cut this open. It's a, it's a very heavy box and I really don't want to puncture any of the other things that are inside. Oh, look at that. It's a letter. Let me check this out before I read it on camera. <laughs> okay so it just says hooray here's the loot that you asked for i hope you love it uh it's hand signed by the owners that's pretty cool uh so i checked out their their instagram it's pretty hot there's like a guy with really cool beard it's just some really manly tough stuff and i really like it there's another one. okay there's a lot of writing on this box okay so this is one thing are these all handwritten? If they are, this is some really cool stuff. You can see there's nothing else in this box. So these are two boxes inside. Let me get rid of the rest of this swag. This is paper. This ASMR, you guys, y'all like that sound? I know y'all do. If I whisper to you, do y'all like it? <laughs> all right, so I'm gonna get rid of all this extra stuff. Uh, okay, so this all looks handwritten. It's the exact same thing on both boxes at least it appears to be yes it is so we're gonna take a close look at one of them we're gonna, there you go so if you want right now you can take the time and uh, screenshot this and you can read it to yourselves hey sick so this has already got me hyped this is some of the best boxing that I've seen like and it's just I don't know, I feel like I, I know these people now because the way they took the time to write on everything. There you go, so shameless promotion. I'm gonna let you go check out their website. Go check it out. Tell them uh, 31 Accountant Eric Lee sent you. And also hit up their Instagram, look at that. Man, this is so this all looks handwritten. But let's not wait any longer. Let's see what's inside, let me just. So man, just a hair a bit more. There we go. Crack this open. <laughs> okay, I guess this is for, uh, well, I guess this be for the ladies or the guys. I only shower with outlaws. Okay, this is a sticker. This is going somewhere. This, guys, this is gonna go on something. Y'all gonna see it in the background or something on one of my future posts. That's pretty cool, you know? I'm about that outlaw life. Y'all seen beard? <laughs> This is their thing. I also like this little logo. The tree in the background, the cowboy hat, the dog. It's pretty dope. Okay, and this is the owner, the boss. Okay, so she reached out to me personally about this soap and was like, I got something that's gonna blow your mind. And that's pretty dope. And she also likes the channel, so shout out to that. The channel getting bigger, guys. So before we move on, I want you to take the time to like and subscribe if you haven't already you know jump on that 31 train and check out all my future videos so let's get straight into the product Look, they did not play with this packaging they wanted to make sure everything that showed up showed up intact and nice so what is this, this is this an air freshener oh you know this got to go in the car that's pretty cool oh i can smell it already guys y'all get a whiff of that Ah, yes. Okay, so it says spicy, sassy, and a little sweet. I can definitely smell the spice in this. This is, this is pretty dope already. All right. 
So one of the other things that stood out to me a lot when I was unboxing or when I was checking out their website and their uh, Instagram was the name of the scents and they are out of control. Okay, so this is cologne right here. Look at that. Solid cologne. Oh look, the detail even in the inside of boxing. Mountain trees. Man, they really outdid themselves with this packaging. Okay. Another bar of soap. So as you can see, I'm just like gonna I'm actually gonna pull this one out so you can actually see this soap because I can smell it so good. This is rough cut, hand cut soap, and that scent already I can smell like cinnamon. Oh man, it smells good. And it feels good in the hands already. It's like oily already. And oh god it's like an air freshener almost like i don't know of just like natural scents like they really went above and beyond and this is sassy sassy a little sweet or spicy sassy a little sweet uh it's pretty dope soap let's see that focus and cool packaging so this is four ounces which you know it's a average size soap kind of compared to most of the other soaps that i i've reviewed on this channel so I'm going to end up giving you guys an update and let you know how long this bar of soap is going to last me. Uh, but so far, everything looks good. So we have so far the soap and the cologne and the, and the air freshener. I'm just going to zoom out just a hair bit. There we go. So we can start getting some of this other stuff in. Okay, so then here we have the body wash. And this is hefty. Okay, so, oh, no wonder. This is actually metal. I'm gonna actually, well, no, I'm not gonna spray it now. I'm gonna spray it in a second after I open up the other box. And this is eight ounces, uh, but the container itself, I mean, you could just like hit somebody upside the head with it, game over for them. Uh, it has a story on the background. I'm gonna zoom in. You can take a screenshot of that and read it to yourself. Okay. So this is all, you know, natural variety, clove, orange, and cinnamon. So I told you I smell cinnamon. Clove was the other thing I was trying to smell. Uh, orange, I can smell a little bit of orange, but I definitely smell the cinnamon and the clove in this one. And the next one is gonna be the body lotion. These are all the same scents. These are all clove, orange, and cinnamon. Spicy, sassy, and a little sweet. That might be my new tagline. I might bite that from them. That's pretty cool. Okay, and this is also a metal container. So these guys do really good. With, let me see if there's anything else. There is, ah, something that almost, almost got past me. There's a little, little rubber chicken up in here, guys. Come on, tell me that doesn't make your day. A little bitty rubber chicken. See, these people got a sense of humor. I seen these on their Instagram. And so I got one in my package. I'm pretty happy about that. Don't mind my hands, I've been in the gym. All right, I'm gonna put this back. And we're not done yet. We have a whole nother box. Like I said, guys, I'm trying to get this channel growing up. Uh, knock out these videos. Because in a little bit, my twin daughters will be born and I might have to take a slight little break. So I'm trying to trying to get to it. Fight dirty, smell clean. See, this is something I can live by. I don't care about, you know, throwing dirt in your, your eyes or anything like that. I gotta win. I gotta home, go home to these twins. All right, so let me put this up here. You guys can check it out. Got the boss again. These should be like playing cards. Boss playing cards. My boss beat your boss. I don't know, something cool about that. Still the stickers. I don't know if I went over these stickers earlier, but these are pretty dope. And you can see, that's the boss. Bunch of outlaws with the guitars. You know I love my guitars, keeping the background. Kiki be killing it. Oh, snap. More packaging. Hold on, I think I just dropped something. Yeah. Okay, the chicken was on top on this one. That is so cool. It's just these little tastes, these little, these little quirky things that just separate these different products from each other. 
it's just that extra mile they go to to I don't know just make it personalized so already they're winning so another air freshener this one's pretty dope too same as the last one we gonna move on okay so this bar so is hair of the dog and it's supposed to be it says whiskey makes you frisky so i know a little something about that you know i don't drink much but i like whiskey you know it's the outlaw lifestyle right there oh uh, this soap's not wanting to cooperate help me please uh, okay so they this is probably bigger than what they said because it was hard to fit in this it was hard to get out this might be like four and a half ounces okay so still this one's a little rough cut too and let me get that scent real quick oh i like this this what is this one this one's really nice and it's a little more mellow smelling than the last one but it's still spicy yeah i'm gonna I'm gonna be rocking this one and this is these soaps are all made and crafted in the u.s see right there says it i love the fact they're still using that uh that cardboard type material this stuff is biodegradable it's good for the environment and it's still personalized so you can see all this stuff if you want to look at the back you can screenshot it right now and uh read it at your own time whiskey and coffee baby okay and this is another solid cologne That's pretty cool. It's all pocket size. Actually, I'm gonna open this one up so you can see what's inside. Please don't let me break nothing. Okay, this just slides out. And you can see the kind of container you got. That is pretty cool. So it's the Gambler right here. And this is just a one ounce, solid, good shape. A good shape <laughs> good packaging is 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 good man everything so far is really solid very professional it says something on the inside if we can focus okay you read that all right cool and put that back in there so this is kind of the way this opens up it's kind of like uh what are those big matches trays the big matches i know i'm not crazy i think i'm saying that right like how the matches are when you just click them out the side pull out a match that is as western as it gets as the whole lighting up a cigarette or whatever they're lighting up right before they get the gun fighting okay guys i'm back that was weird i guess my battery died i swear i charged it but i guess i put in the wrong one i know i make mistakes too it's okay so getting back to the body wash it's pretty good the gambler's still still dope i can't wait to check these scents out Look at that, the playing cards on there. They really put a lot of detail and a lot of thought went into this and the scents are so authentic and like, oh, manly. Smell good. So this is the body lotion, also a gambler. So some of the things that are in this scent, let me focus for me. As you can read that, it says bourbon, tobacco, and a hint of leather. Like, I mean, come on. If that doesn't sound like the wild wild west and a bunch of rambling outlaws i don't know what does so that's both box and i don't think i said this uh calamity jane i didn't say the name of this i was looking at that earlier and the sense for this one like i said earlier is clove orange and cinnamon so this is what you get very nice packaging still they want to make sure that you can tell that no one's used this before even though you know it's handcrafted handmade these items are legit and they are very professionally put together and there's so much where's my other chicken don't judge me guys i'm really about that life with the chicken okay here it is oh no okay so my other chicken all right let's go back up top so we're back up top and as you just seen the unboxing all the stuff that uh, i received from outlaw soap 
I am impressed. I'm impressed by the craftsmanship, the boxing, everything that went into it, all the, you know, like the quirky things, like the little chickens. I don't know if you can see this, but you, you already seen it. Overhead, the soap, the size, the packaging, just overall, like the quality is just, mm. uh, but right now I'm a little sweaty. I'm a little stinky. I'm going to jump in this shower, use one of these body wash. Uh, actually, I got key. She's going to use one too. So she's going to be using the Calamity Jane. I think I said that right. Uh, oh, okay, so this one doesn't have any any playing cards on it like the other one. I just noticed that. Uh, okay, hold on. So the body wash. Okay, yeah, you're right. The body wash, the Calamity Jane doesn't have this soap. It just has a uh, the, it has a person and the uh, the gambler has the card. So everything's like really well thought out. So Key's gonna use the Calamity Jane. I'm gonna use the gambler. Uh, we're gonna try it out, and I'll let you know what we think about. Uh, the body wash, the lotions, uh, and the soap, which the soap is a little easier to deal with. Uh, right now, I can, I can smell the scents, and I got retail they're going to be a win. But the next time you see me, I'll be fresh and clean with Outlaw Soap. Check me out. All right, guys, so fresh out the shower, feeling fresh and clean, looking good, smelling better. So I'm going to tell you guys what I thought about the whole, the whole deal, the whole Outlaw soap, uh, the products that they use, how they smell, how they feel, and how they make you feel. Uh, but I'm gonna start off by saying, this ain't for everybody. This is for the grown, the sexy, the people ain't afraid to get dirty. So what I end up using, well, let me talk, start with what Key used. Key used the uh, Calamity Jane body wash and lotion. And I'm gonna tell you, the scent, I can smell it from the other room as she was taking her shower. The scent is amazing. It's nice, clean, the whole nine yards, man. It smells like area, all the ingredients in here, the orange, the clove, and the cinnamon. Like, it's banging. It's very, very balanced, uh, to say the least. But when she got the shower, it was not the strongest scent after getting out. Not a problem. Because once she put that lotion on, that the same... You know the calamity jane lotion everything was popping the scent was strong again it's i don't know together they work amazing uh so that was her experience she loved the way it feels on her skin she's pregnant so you know a little sensitive skin everything worked out great she loved it she gave it two thumbs up but let me talk about my experience guys so i ended up using the gambler and mine was <laughs> considerably stronger scent uh, in the shower as well as the lotion so in a shower the the soap is transparent it's clear and it lathers up great I mean it doesn't take a lot uh, if you put on your little loofah get your body all lathered up it does not take a lot to get and I'm a big man I mean I'm like six foot four whole nine yards it didn't take much maybe about two pumps and I was good I cover my whole body great lather great smell like I said getting back to the grown and sexy smell because this one was uh, it's bourbon tabas uh, <laughs> tobacco and uh, a hint of leather and I could tell you I could smell the bourbon like when I got up and there I was like military days you know gave me a little flashback being in the club at night you know what I'm talking about if you know you know if you don't know yeah so <laughs> so when it came to the lotion though uh let me just show you let me show you i'm gonna take this little this ring off and i'm gonna get into the lotion lotion was by far my favorite of all the products because um the body wash is a great scent i mean it gives you a mild scent so it doesn't really clash with if you want to put cologne on but once you put this lotion on that's what you smell like it is legit it, it just, ugh, it's good. And it's also smooth. If you can see my skin now, I was probably ashy when I was doing an unboxing, but your boy ain't ashy no more. So I'm gonna put on a little bit of this body lotion, let you guys see what it looks like. If you can see, so this lotion isn't like what you would have normally got. Uh, say if you got like, what is that? The coconut, cocoa body lotion cocoa butter. stuff? Yeah, the cocoa butter, the cheap cocoa. Mm, that cocoa butter that you know you know the cheap stuff is all watery this ain't it this is not that this is leaving your skin looking look just look at the back of my hand you see it all glistening ain't no glitter in there that's just smooth 
skin just flossing in the light. And uh, that's what it does for you. But it also that scent is, it makes you smell manly and strong. So I'm gonna try to describe the way I view these scents. And so uh, the best way I would say is, is these scents aren't for people who, these aren't for kids. These scents like obviously tobacco is in one of the ingredients and not like smoked tobacco, but like as if you're walking into some place where you could just smell the plants and all this stuff, it's, oh, it's just great. So like coffee, think of like the smell of coffee in the morning before, or like before it's brewed. That's what you, that's the kind of tobacco smell. I hope this makes sense guys. So is this is for grownups. This is for people who are brave enough to do their own thing. Uh, who aren't afraid to get their hands dirty. I know when hunting season come around, I'm gonna be putting this on, you know, be out in the woods doing my thing, getting my hands dirty, doing a whole nine yards. Uh, and this is for them, the people who are not afraid to walk off the beaten path. Uh, that's the best way I can explain this. Uh, maybe there's other ways, but this is my way. So overall, the body, the body wash and the lotions, I give them two thumbs up. They are amazing. They smell like what was advertised and they are for the grown and sexy. So the only two things I still have to open up are gonna be uh, the cologne. So we will start with uh, Calamity Jane. I, I keep hoping I'm saying this right. You know your boy can't say nothing, right? Uh, so, okay, I'm gonna pop this out. Okay, uh, it says, this is a little saying on the inside. Uh, it says, I have vision and the rest of the world wears bifocals. And this is by Butch Cassidy. Come on, that's a famous guy. I know that name. We're going to get this opened up. Oh, that smells good. See, this is a more subtle scent uh, versus the Gambler. This is, I guess this one could be for anybody because it's not too crazy. It smells, uh, it smells good, but it's a little little subtle but man it's 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 nice it's that up and close and personal it's the one that you don't put on your wrist you put it on your neck let them come over there and say what's up <laughs> okay but uh i think it's only fair that i go ahead and open up the other one the outlaw uh the gambler so the gambler one oh let me read the inside of this one too Okay, so this says, the Old West is not a certain place in a certain time. It's a state of mind. It's whatever you want it to be by Tom Mix. I don't know who Tom Mix is, so don't clown me in the comments. Uh, but I love that saying. So, oh, yeah, this is, uh, I messed up already. All right, we're putting it on the other wrist. Uh, oh, yeah, that's the one. So this is. If you live in Florida and Texas, you need to buy this. This is like, I got money. This is what, this is what this scent is. It's like I got money and I'm grown, and I pay my own bills and I do all my own stuff. But I'm not afraid to go out and get my hands dirty because this is what these scents smell like. And as you can tell, I even had to change when I got out the shower. I had to put on a collared shirt. I just felt grown. And, like Rico Suave. I wish I had a shirt. The shirt got the flamingos on it, but if I had one that had chickens on it, that'd be the shirt I'm, <laughs> I'll be wearing right now. But guys, if you found this video to be entertaining, uh, educational, or you just like me, go ahead and take the time right now to hit that like button, subscribe, and uh, push that little bell so you can be notified every time I upload a new video. This is Outlaw Soap. I'm Eric Lee, and you're watching 31 and Counting. We out.